Hi, and welcome back to my channel. Today, I will show you the rest of the items that I ordered from Nordstrom's clearance sale. So if you're interested, just keep watching. Sometimes I feel like I talk really fast and I've been told that I talk really slow. <laughs> I can't be everybody's cup of tea. My speaking speed depends on what I have going on for the day. So it's just the beginning of the day. I haven't had breakfast yet, but I wanted to go ahead and follow up with the haul that I did while on vacation. So this dress that I have on is one that I tried on. I felt like the extra small really accentuated here. So I went ahead and got a small. And I really do like this dress. It's really pretty. I know that a lot of people didn't like the shoulder pads, but I'm an 80s baby. So shoulder pads are my thing. <laughs> I like shoulder pads. I feel like it triangles your shape so you kind of go in like that where your waist appears smaller than what it is i am wearing it with these shoes that i got from ross and these are vince camuto i bought them for like 20 dollars, and i thought they were a lot like the birkenstock but they have the little furry inside and so i've been wearing these around the house they have the bottom where i could wear them out but Vince Camuto at Ross, 20 bucks, was better to me than paying a hundred and something dollars for Birkenstocks. So I thought it looked cute with this dress. Now, I don't know that I would wear a belt with this, but I really do like the slit on the side. This retailed for 68, but I got it for 49, which is still on the high end, I feel like. But overall, I just like the aesthetic of this dress. It's very neutral. I can wear it with my new bag and not worry about color transfer. So I thought it was really, really pretty. The other dress that I bought was this All Saints dress and it retailed for $139 and it was on clearance for $83. I do like this dress. It's very soft, very elegant. It also has a slit on the side. I mean, you can tell the quality of this dress compared to this dress. Like this dress is amazingly soft and beautiful. It's just a pretty, pretty leisure wear dress. And with a cardigan or something on top, I thought it would be really, really pretty. This is the only other dress that I bought. Now, as you saw in the pictures, I did buy this shirt. I did want it in a medium. This one is a small and it fits okay, but I really wanted a medium. This one was originally 58 and I got it for 34 and it's a free people shirt. And it's really cute. I like the threading on the collar. I think it's really, really nice. And then it has this little patchwork on the back. The sleeves also have some different threading on it. So I like the yellow and just the combination of this shirt. I did also try these on in store. This is Waif. This dress also is Waif. And I did like this. These retailed for 55 and I got them for 33. They're in a size small. And they're just a cute little lounge short. They are really long on me and kind of baggy here because I am shorter. And so they do fit a little strange, but <laughs> I want to try it on with the shirt. Now the shirt I had to order online. They did not have it in store. And so let me open this up. It looks like it's packaged pretty nice, so I don't think that it had been returned or anything. But here is the shirt. It doesn't have the pricing on it, but there's the brand right there. And this is the small. And so I thought like overall, these were gonna be pretty oversized and so that's why I chose to get the small. Now, sometimes I like to get a bigger size for the length, but sometimes it just doesn't work out that way. Like, I feel like I get a bigger size and then it's just bigger. It's not longer. 
So I'll try that on. Really, really cute set. And then I did try on this Madewell Cami in store. I believe I tried on the small. And I really felt like I needed a bigger size up. So I got the medium in this. This retails for $29.50. And I believe the sell price was $17 or something. I'll put it on the screen. But it's just a simple cami. But it's very, very pretty. Kind of this oatmeal color. And... I like to have camis to wear underneath my blazers or anything like that. So yeah, I think this one would be, this one's gonna be a better fit for me. I didn't like the way the other one was just so tight on my breasts. I wanted something a little bit more loose. And then I didn't try this on in the video or take any pictures because they had a size small, and this was like some last minute things that I was throwing in before I checked out. <laughs> but this is the Hologen Taupe Animal Print Cardigan. And they had a small, but again, I'm tired of going by sizing. I just want items that are gonna fit me well with clothes underneath because sometimes I feel like I get the small and it fits me fine in store but then I want to wear something underneath and it doesn't fit well. This one retails for $69 but it was on clearance. And so that's what that looks like. It's so pretty and the length on it is really good. It goes below my hip area. I would say my thigh starts right here and that's how far down it goes it is very very pretty thin thin enough to wear as we transition from summer to the cooler weather when we get into that time where it's kind of cool in the morning and then it's hot by the afternoon so i thought this cardigan was so so pretty i know i have a ton of cardigans but i don't have a cardigan that's this long and again a lot of the animal print is really used as a neutral in a lot of situations. Like I feel I could wear solid black under this, solid neutrals, maybe even a monochrome color and just set it off with this. So the sleeves are a little bit long, but I do like it. Wow, that makes my arms look really, really long. <laughs> my arms are not that long, I don't think. But yeah, I thought this was really, really pretty. And so I did like this as well. The deal of the day, I felt like, was this ivory hoodie. This, when I put it on in store, I just loved it. And it's a neutral color, which I like, but also... I like that it's not really hot. This is from Open Edit and it's a size small because what I tried on in store was an extra small. It was okay, but I wanted more of that oversized fit. This is a small, y'all. Look how big it looks. In fact, I'm going to go ahead and slip it on on top of this dress just so you can see. But I definitely wanted this to wear over leggings this retailed for 39 but it's on sale for 17 so i bought it for 17 dollars and i really did want it to wear with leggings see how far down it goes and i just love this oversized fit again it's a lot like the sweater it feels cool and it's a transition piece from the hot hot weather to maybe the cool in the morning hot in the afternoon weather but it is really really pretty like i really like this i like that it's a neutral color i like that it has a pocket it also does have a hood and so i thought this was really really pretty for 17 dollars, you can't beat it this is nice quality hoodie 
for the price. And so, yeah, I thought this was really, really pretty. So I'm waiting on one more sweater that I think will be coming this week. It's been the one that I ordered during the anniversary sale that has been on back order this whole time. And so I'm just waiting for it to come and then I will show you that. But I'm glad that I'm getting a lot of neutral colors so that I can wear with my new bag because I definitely don't want to wear anything that's gonna have any color transfer. So I'll just go ahead and insert footage here of what that sweater looks like. And that will be the end of my video. So thank you for watching and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye.